Ladies and gentlemen, my name is Theo Green, and this week on the Player Spotlight, we have three-year starter, captain of the Maritime Privateers, John Driscoll. So, John, tell me about yourself. <clears throat> my name is John Driscoll. I'm from Seaford, Long Island. Uh, I went to Seaford High School. I uh, play midfield for the Swimming Maritime Lacrosse team. I'm number nine. And uh, if you want to follow me, I'm at the Driz9 on Twitter. You know, I'll be giving pregame posts, pregame tweets before the games. Come by. Can you tell me what your best memory from playing lacrosse is? Honestly, I could probably say that I, I remember I was actually maybe about 10 years old when I first started playing lacrosse. And I remember the day that the coach took me to the side and the jilly was like, this is how you throw, this is how you catch. Like moving, ca catching with your top hand up top and throwing with your bottom hand up bottom. And ever since then, I've been just doing my thing. Definitely. Fundamental game. Can you name three people that you'd love to have dinner with? Definitely my Aunt Kathy. She passed away four years ago on Valentine's Day. So these, the Valentine's Day was last week. I would definitely love to have her there. And being that the Giants just came off a Super Bowl victory, Victor Cruz and uh, Akeem Nix, you know, hang out, relax, have a couple drinks, you know. Exactly. Hang out with the champs. Hang out with the champs. John, can you tell me what you would eat for your last meal here on Earth? Honestly, uh, Old American Burger, Massapequa, New York. Probably, without a doubt, the best burgers, best fries, best milkshakes there are. All right, John, can you tell me something about yourself that would surprise most people? I happen to be a very good karaoke singer. What's your go-to karaoke song? Basically, anything that Rick James plays. Give it to my baby. So where do you see yourself in 10 years? LA, Hollywood. I can really just see myself on the big screen for some reason. It's something I've always wanted to do. I always felt natural being on camera. And having a family with a, you know, a wife, blonde, three kids. God help me if I have three daughters, but you know, what happens, happens. How do you want people to remember you? Well, it's kind of a hard question to answer, but I definitely want people to always remember me by someone who always liked to have a good time. But on a more serious note, someone who can always count on. Yeah, definitely. Good friend to have. John, it was great having you on the show. Ladies and gentlemen, tune in next week for more Player Spotlight of the Week. Thank you for having me. It's great. Anytime. Welcome back. Anytime. I'll see if I got time.